I just finished creating over 100 Facebook ad variations in less than 10 minutes using a completely free AI tool that most advertisers have never heard of. And I'm going to show you the exact same method I've used step by step so you can do the same for your business. It's honestly going to completely change the way you think about Facebook ads. So let's get straight into it. I just got done recording a separate video talking about creative formatting. Now, very quick intro as to why this video is important for you. Meta and Meta has came out a few weeks ago and now more than ever doing a lot of different creative variations and formats, the more differentiated messaging and styles that you have, the better your ad account performs. Okay. Meta is all about creative volume. So you have to find ways in order to increase your creative production. So I want to talk about using Nano Banana today, which is Google's AI image editing features in order to produce a lot of these variations. Okay. So what you can do, and I'll just do a very quick demonstration to start in the e-commerce space. I'll do the same thing in the service business space in a second. So you can do something as simple as this. So say as an example, now I have a swap file of ads like I personally do right here with a bunch of different ads that I've, you know, saved templates from different swap files I've bought, so on and so forth. Okay. Well, number one, before what you had to do is you had to take this template send it to a graphic designer, then they would like edit the template, they would like swap out this product for your product, they would like edit the text and then you're like, okay, you know, real human, I would have to blah, 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 right, I would have to change all those things manually. So what I can do now is use a mix of AI to help me do this. So as an example, right, I could just take this end result right here. So I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna take a screenshot of this end ad right there. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go right here and say collagen one as an example. OK, so I'm going to take something like this, any sort of collagen one that I can figure out. So let me try to find one right here. So now if I head over to Google as an example, I'm going to save this image right here of another product I want to swap out. So just let me just assume for a second. OK, this is like my product. So I'm going to take a screenshot off of it right there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Gemini. I'm going to put in the original ad that I saved. Or actually, let me just upload that right here. So I'm going to add files, upload, take this image right here, and then take both of the images I got. So the original ad I want to swap out and then my product that I want to put in there. So all I'm going to do is ask Gemini to swap my product for this one. So here's the result, right? This was the original ad. This was the text that was on there. I gave it my product. I said, hey, use the static image I gave you the one with the green background and swap out the bottle for mine. OK, and this is the image I got right here. So it gave me pretty much the same exact text right here. It just removed one of the points at the bottom. And now I could reprompt this image so I could copy that one image, put it back right here, in my prompt, and I could ask it to change the text on the left hand side. So let's do it like one by one as an example. So I'm going to ask it to change this headline right here at the top. And there you go. Here's exactly what we got, right? Same font right here. It says change the power of real human stem cells text to reduce fine lines with her collagen one. There you go. We have a static ad, reduce fine lines with their collagen one. Now, how is that different than GPT's DALI model? Well, first of all, with Nano Banana, this takes literally about three to five seconds. Like it's very quick to generate images, much quicker than DALI. Hence why you can make like a gazillion variations really fast from those images. And again, you don't depend anymore on a graphic designer. You don't need to be good at Photoshop or Canva or even at editing templates and, and swap files on Figma as an example. All you got to have access to is one, anything that is out there from your competitors. So all of their creative formats, and you can just swap in and out your own, you know, images right here and put them there. And I could further prompt it to add another line right here as an example to link this benefit to my product. I could change those benefits one by one right here. I usually recommend it go like one thing at a time. If you gave it too many instructions to say like, Hey, change this text to that, change this text to this. Sometimes it gets a little confused. So I just like, edit a couple times the same image takes two to three seconds every time I do like one variation. And usually within like a minute or so, I'll have like a fully finished ad right there. So I can like move on and do a second one and so on and so forth. Now, here's another example I just gave right here to Gemini. I was like, look, here's an ad right here for a service business or for another type of business than an e-commerce business. And I was like, look, here's three other websites right here. And I was like, hey, take the static example I just gave you swap out, you know, the images in the background for the websites that just gave you put some red X on it and then just swap out the text. And here's what I got. Is your website not converting or just looks outdated? There you go. Right. And if you're asking about this little thing right here, this like Gemini logo that you got in the bottom right corner from using Nano Banana, 
bunch of free tools first of all online it can help you remove those watermarks if you still have access to photoshop or canva canva has magic eraser tool photoshop has content aware fill which literally you would just put it on it and it would remove it so as an example if i just copy this right here i open up photoshop right there what i can then do in photoshop is just come here in the bottom right corner select this and i could just go remove right here or let me take the layer and i go remove and it would just start removing this gradually so Give it a second boom there you go it's finished it just removed this little icon now i can save that and there you go i got a whole ad i can now use for my website design agency as an example now to finalize this point right here another use case that we have for it is just swapping out some of our own pictures so say you're working with different ugc creators or say you want to swap out like one of your other products for something else you can also do this right like to kind of take this example right here i could screenshot this ad which we're going to use like as a base so let me just actually make a copy off of it and I'm going to make as big as possible on my screen to get the highest quality version of this ad so I'm going to take this I'm going to go back to Gemini open a new thread put that image right here as say the base image I'm going to go back right now to my swap files and go up and what I'm going to do here as an example is take this woman right here and swap out her for the background of this other ad and there you have it. Now you have the woman right here just swapped out on this ad right there. So I've just swapped out UGC creators, but I could swap out the product. I could swap out the text once again. So Nano Banana is amazing to help you take inspiration from either other ads of competitors or to help you swap into some of the swap files and templates that you might have already saved or to simply help you test a lot more variations because you could, as an example, be the one who owns those creatives. But instead of having to ask your designer like, hey, take this photo, remove the background from this new UGC creator, put it on Photoshop, swap her out in the background. You could just go to Nano Banana, take your own picture, throw it in there and just say, hey, look, here's another screenshot of another UGC creator of ours. Just swap them out. That's it. So it just helps you, again, create a lot more variations fast. I cannot stress this point enough. And one of the core reasons why I do this video is coming back to another video I just got done recording today, which was about creative formatting. Meta, Andrew Meta wants you to have more creative formats, wants you to test more variables in your ads. I think Nano Banana, because of how fast it is, when you give it a prompt like this one to execute on it, which literally, again, two to three seconds, usually I get a result from it. It just helps you speed up your production of ad creatives much further than if you had to have a manual graphic designer do all of this work. And so if you want to learn more about some of the ways in which we use AI to produce more ad creatives at scale to thrive in this Andromeda era, then check out the link below to join my ad engine one-on-one -on -one inner circle to have me personally work with you to review your ads, offers, funnels, strategies, name it, and implement some of what's been mentioned in today's video and much, much more. You can also apply to work with our agency down below and do check out other videos on the channel for some more useful marketing tips. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.